You know, I used to worry about what people thought about me. I used to worry that I wasn't as good looking as another man. I used to think that I wasn't good enough. Well, I'm here to tell you, sister, I'm 51 and those days are gone. I love who I am. And as long as I have one person that gets something from my videos and my books and my blogs, then I've done what I was put here for. I've always liked to push buttons a little bit. I've always liked to give people something to talk about because people are going to run their mouth. So at least if I give them something to talk about, then at least I know what they're saying. No big secret. Um, you know, there's a lot of good looking men out on Facebook. There's a lot of hot looking men on Facebook. And there's guys out there that probably um, you might think you can't have or don't deserve. And it's not because they're hot. It's because they're either players or they are um, scammers. But at the end of the day, it's okay to um, find hot-looking men and appreciate a good-looking man. Even if you never speak one word. Because at the end of the day, not everybody's going to return it. All you can do is own your own devout. Yeah. All you can do is own your own individuality and own your own sexiness. sexiness. God knows what gifts he gave you. And God knows your beauty. Man's beauty fades. God stays forever. At the end of the day, the only opinion that matters and the only one that you need to feel sexy for or feel like you are attractive or that you've got it going on, other than just know it, is trust in God. I do. And I feel sexy and... I feel a good look, you know, like a good looking man. I am a good looking man. Even under all the envelopes I push and all the looks at the end of the day, he thinks I'm beautiful. He thinks I'm hot. At the end of the day, he gave me my groove. So, I'm going to get my groove back with or without your help. Have a nice day.